Good morning or good afternoon and welcome to Vlogmas Day number three. So I am getting ready to get in the shower here. Um, I'm getting ready to upload Vlogmas Day number two from yesterday. And um, it's afternoon because I go back to work tonight because I was off Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday nights I go back to work. It's my Monday so I go in at 9 o'clock tonight and... Um, so yesterday I went to bed, I slept for just a little bit, but then I woke up and then, um, I stayed up all night kind of watching my YouTube videos, uh, catching up on all my subscriptions and stuff. And then, um, so I could sleep late today in the afternoon because I have to get up, get the kids, get dinner. And then Brad gets off work at eight, gets home by eight thirty, And then I leave and go right to work at night. So, um, I can't take a nap in the evening or anything. So I have to kind of sleep late in the afternoon so that I can stay up all night at work. So if any of you worked overnight, so you know how your schedule gets kind of switched around with all your sleeping and everything. So it gets kind of crazy. But anyway, I'm going to get in the shower here and then I'm going to go get Natalie from school and then I'm going to go pick up Mackenzie from daycare. Okay, I'm on my way to pick up Natalie from school. All right, I am kind of running late today picking her up and there's like I'm way at the back of the line you can see up there there's a huge line up there usually I'm like way up there towards the front up there at least kind of I mean the front of the line is into the parking lot by the door but I'm usually like further up there but I'm running kind of late today all right we're moving along and almost up to where she is to pick her up. All right, I'm an American Eagle. Real quick, before we get Mackenzie, I have, need a pair of jeans. I ordered a pair online for Black for Cyber Monday, but I normally wait to buy it in the store, so I see if it fits me better, because my other jeans are getting worn out. All right, so I found me a couple pairs of jeans and they were buy one, get one half off. So that was cool. And I found a belt and I got Brad a pair of jeans. And now I need to stop and find me some, I need to get some socks because I'm my socks all have holes and are worn down. So I need to get some more socks. I'm gonna stop at JCPenney's because I get the gold toe socks. And I forgot to get them when we were out there yesterday. So I'm gonna stop by there and then we'll be off to pick McKenzie up. All right. I. And stopping at Price Chopper to check for the creamer one last time. And if they just have the big one, I'm going to just break down and get the big one. And then we are going to get McKenzie finally after this. Okay, it was a no-go at Price Chopper for the creamer. They didn't have it at all, not even in the, the bigger one. So now we are picking up McKenzie finally at daycare. One last stop for this creamer here. All right. Here we go. I'm not seeing it. Okay, no creamer at Sunfresh either. So I guess next time I'm back at Target, I'm gonna go back and get, just get the bigger size because I can't find the smaller size anywhere and a lot of places don't even have it at all. So I know the Target had the bigger size, so I will just go back there. I don't have time to go tonight. So next time I'm out that way, I will stop and just get the bigger one. Okay, so I just got home and I am fixing dinner real quick here. Just having some fish sticks and macaroni and cheese because we got home late. 
So hopefully tomorrow we can have a, a regular dinner, a better dinner than what we've had the rest of the week. It's been just kind of quick meals so far this week, and then I'm going to um, get ready to go to work here in a little bit. I'm actually, they've been talking to my work about switching our hours, because I think starting in January, um, they're going to switch it with the Postal Service to where it's not guaranteed that you get your mail the next day, like, say you mail it like a card to like say your next door neighbor. Normally you would get that they would get it like the next day if it's just like right in your same town. But I guess it's not gonna be guaranteed starting in January. It's gonna be where it could take like two or three days to get to the you know, it's not gonna be guaranteed the next day. Maybe like two or three days. So I'm not sure exactly how that goes, but they may end up getting rid of the overnight deliveries. I mean, not overnight, the overnight processing. So they're talking about getting rid of overnight shift completely and then just having people work on the daytime shift and then the evening shift. So, and then processing the mail, like I guess in the day and just in the evenings instead of overnight, since it doesn't have to be out till like the second or third day. So they may just put us all on days or evenings. So I'm hoping if that happens, I will go to days because um, I don't like evenings at all. I worked evenings when I was, um, when I first started about 15, well, 17 years ago I started. And then right after that, I worked on tour three and I didn't like it at all because you have no time to be at home or do anything. You like, if anything goes on the evening, you can't go because you have to work or, um, anything in the evening you can't do because you're always working except for on your days off of course but um but like of overnights when you're overnights you get to work um in the mornings for overnight and then in the mornings you can sleep and get up and do something and then sleep a little bit more in the, in the evening or you can sleep whenever you pretty much have the whole day off you just got to sleep sometime but that's kind of why I like overnights because it's much, much easier when you want to do stuff. But the evening shift, I just don't like at all. So I'm hoping, hoping, hoping I don't have to do the evening shift. But I'd much rather do the day shift, even though I'm not really a morning person. And I don't, I hate driving in the morning brush hour traffic, but I'd much rather work those hours and have my evenings off so I could still be home and be able to do things and still see Brad and, and be able to do, you know, see the kids and everything. So... We'll see. I'll find out more probably in the next few weeks on what's going on with that. So anyway, I'm going to finish dinner here, and then I'm going to have to start um, helping Nellie with her homework real quick in just a second. The kids are watching Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. Don't give up. What we need is a mouse gatool. Everybody say... All right, so I just got the kids dinner and everything, and Brad just got home, so I'm getting ready to head to work. I have to be there at 9 o'clock, so hopefully I have a good night at work. You'll be doing all right with your Christmas of light, but I have a blue, 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 blue Christmas. All right, I'm at work. Let's see where I can park. I always have to park way in the back. Because it's like super busy here. At night. Okay, so I just got home from work and I am getting ready to take Natalie to school. And then after that, I will be heading to bed shortly. Um, I will have to up... I'm going to edit this vlog real quick before I, before I go to bed and then upload it because I was trying to figure out when I should um, start and end my vlogs because when I go back to work because I work, sleep opposite everybody else. I work all night long, then come home in the morning, then go to bed in the morning and get up around like three or four or so. So I thought maybe I should start them in the morning when I get home from work and then end them when I go to work or start them when I wake up and then end them when I get home from work in the morning. So I think I'm just going to do that. I'm going to start them 
when I get up in the afternoon or evening, and then I'm going to end them when I get home from work in the next morning. So, but then of course my day's off, it'll be starting from the morning to the night, just like everybody else. So, um, I guess I'm going to end it for now and I'm going to take Natalie to school here and then I am headed to bed. So I will see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 4.